Oh, this is so pretty. It's a tub mat, y'all. Let me open it so y'all can see. It's not long enough. I like long ones, but it'll do. Oh, this is for Pia. Oh, this is so cute. I love my gold, y'all. I love my gold. So, this is for my kitchen. Oh, this is nice and it's big, too. Oh, I like this. It's for my um pot scrubbers because I don't have nothing to hold it. So, yeah, that's nice. And then this is... Let me move this box off the table. My hands stay ashy, y'all. Don't talk about my hands. <laughs> so this is for my kitchen, y'all. This trying to give me a hard time to open it. Oh, the bag is beautiful. I like that. A nice silk bag. All right, let's see what's inside. This is so pretty. All right, let me take all my spoons out. Yo, this is so nice. It's a utensil holder, of course. This is so nice, y'all. I'm gonna put them inside, but normally I like to wash all my spoons. But I'm gonna just let y'all see what it looks like. This is nice. So this is, I'm not gonna use this to cook, y'all. It's just for show. It's gonna sit on my kitchen counter. And voila. I got some red potatoes. I got some corn on the cob. I got some beef kibosky. I got two dozens of blue claw. They are male crabs, and I had some jumbo shrimp. But let me show y'all what these crabs look like. Can't put no crabs in no dirty sink, of course. All right, so I'm going to let them soak in this water for a little bit, and then I'm going to start popping the backs off. I'm going to let the sink fill up a little bit more.
It's a moving around a lot. He could have gave us some better crabs. Now that I did that, I'm going to start on my juice because I kind of forgot to do my juice. Normally, I do that first. This is the pot I'm going to be using. It's clean, y'all. I'm just giving it a run. This is the beer I'm going to be using. So, you put that in there. Then we're going to we're going to fill the bottle up with water. You do half beer and half water, so your crabs won't be salty. And then you just pour the whole bottle of water. And I have to grab the seasonings that I use, which will be garlic powder, onion powder, um, gray pepper seeds, um, cayenne pepper, and I use sazon. And I can't forget about my crab seasoning. All right. And also butter. So let me grab that. Okay, so I'm gonna be using, I'm gonna be using colors. And also, so I got these two. I'm just gonna take a big spoon of it like this and that should be fine and that's the bay leaf inside the pot y'all now i'm going to add in the crab seasoning see that now i'm going to add in my seasonings this is garlic powder. I normally use a lot of onion powder for flavor. Zoom in on that for me real quick. See how much onion powder I put in y'all? That's a lot, but that's good. And cayenne, not too much, unless you want your crabs really spicy. I like a mild spice. And then red pepper seeds also not too much unless you want it very spicy 
And I think one more thing is crushed garlic. You can put as much as you like the flavor. Oh my goodness. Really? Yeah. I normally do two spoons. Two big spoons. Because it's so good. Take that and stir it around. Let the juice cook for at least a half an hour. Now that the crabs is clean, you want to give them a nice good rinse. This is the last rinse before they be put in the pot to cook. And also the uh, claws as well. So I'm going to use this for my potatoes, corn, sausages, shrimp. Sit those in there. I'm going to rinse my sausage off and place them onto the pan. This is a really big potato.
I have my potatoes boiling. Um, the sausages is in the pot, so I think they're done. I'm going to take them out. That's one. Some onions with it. Just a whole bunch of onions. I'm gonna just take them out. Cause we eat these too. And then I can put my corn inside the pot. The corn you don't want to keep in too long. So I'm gonna let that cook. Check out these potatoes, cause they look like they are soft. Oh yeah, I'm taking them out y'all. The corn is about ready. I'm gonna cook the shrimp last. I don't like cold shrimp. Putting the crabs in a pot with the backs face down. one more crab and that's it put the lid on i have these ones to cook as well but i can throw some of these claws in the pot Alright, so I'm gonna let these cook, y'all.
so y'all everything is finally finished 